So CrossFit is a core strength and conditioning program. And I use the word core in two senses. Not only do I mean core as in like what we call the core of our body, right? But also core as in it is a core functional program. So we use gymnastic movements such as pull-ups, muscle-ups, handstand push-ups, things like that. We use Olympic weightlifting movements, so things like cleans and snatches, what you would see in an Olympic weightlifting competition. Um, and then we also use normal lifts, and then what we call monostructural movements, which are things like running and rowing. CrossFit, I think, is something everyone should at least try. For instance, I'm six months pregnant, and I'm doing CrossFit. I was never an athlete. I am now a CrossFit coach. So it's for everybody. Um, it's for everybody from the 86-year-old grandmother to the, you know, elite athlete who is training in their off-season, trying to just get faster, stronger. CrossFit is infinitely better than going to, say, your local Globo gym. One, it is constantly varied. So I am not, I don't have my Monday by try day, my Tuesday legs chest day. Like, I'm constantly varied and I'm constantly using all parts of my body. I've been doing this for seven years and I am still sore at least once a week. If I am a normal student coming into a capital CrossFit, I have a coach who will not only tell me what I'm supposed to be doing, but make sure that I'm doing it correctly, which is extremely important, especially in some of the you know more complicated movements. But aside from those reasons that are more of the fitness-based reasons, aside from the fact that I've never been in better shape in my entire life, CrossFit gives you such a sense of community. There are just, you have these, you form these bonds with people, you're you're in pain with them every day, you're agonizing with them every day, you're celebrating with them every day, you're competing with them every day, and it makes for some really cool community and friendship.